Hello and welcome to the chill stream. So this is the first in the series, as a, a short note. Uh, I started doing this because I, I just got my room in the FC, I got an apartment and stuff and... You know, at some point I was like, what do I actually want to do in this room? So I decided that once again it's time to go on an adventure and, and check what, what other people have done in their, in their houses. <clears throat> Maybe get some inspiration from there. As it says, uh, it is a bit of a chill stream, so I don't know how much I will talk throughout this. I guess it depends on, on the chat mostly. But I decided that like, I, I would be doing this off stream, but you know, I decided that I may as well just show, show people around. Show, uh, like feature some of the nice ideas that people have. Because this is our FC, the, the duck pond. I mean, it's not like super impressive, but you know, it's cozy. We have this nice like garden-ish area at the top with, with a pond, of course, for the ducks. And we have this entrance here where you can leave your coats and stuff. And when you go downstairs, we have like a, you know, hangout area. The couches. Stuff. Here you can order your food if you want to. And if you get tired, you can come upstairs on the deck. And maybe chilling with some plushies and cushions. So yeah, that's our little FC. We are hoping to get a medium soon to the end, but we're not exactly sure when or if that's gonna happen. So for now, this is it. But today, I wanted to go to Goblet. To be honest, I I, w I got inspired to go to Goblet because I was at the at the was it Cherry Blossom Festival. It was organized by Hagemag. And that was Goblet War 21, actually. And they did this this nice thing. I actually posted a picture on Twitter. They did the nice thing where they put the trees like outside their their fence, so it kind of looks like a little park with like benches and stuff. And I, I feel like that's that's an amazing design. But I'm gonna be going through them in order, most likely. So today we start with Goblet One. Why the bot didn't post in my Discord? Sad. Unfortunately, it's raining and it's also night. Oh my god, I'm also getting some lags. Which is not ideal for you know, showing people around. But this is our little garden as well. Those who follow our streams probably have seen it multiple times. It's really nice to hang out here. And yes, I also like intentionally put this tree like very close to the fence so like you can you kinda get the shade outside of the fence as well. So I'm I'm definitely for like these kind of solutions. But anyway. So I realize this is painfully slow. <laughs> the 
Let's go to goblet number one. I realize now I should probably prepare like a, a, like a tour, like as in like uh, the route that I want to go, but nope, we're just winging it. Here in Goblet One, what would be the, the best way to go? I guess we go this way, right? Yeah, we go this way, we're gonna go around and go to the second row. Yeah, let's do that. Fire starts well. Brave chinchillas. Um, this is indeed a fire hazard, Miss. Oh boy. Chocobos are just chilling. But I am here for the inside designs. So let us see. I get why it's called the fire hazard now. There's there's a lot of fire, yes, going on. The Quigos and the Hupka. Think chess, please. Would it be called chess in yours yet, to be honest? It's a good question. Oh, we have we have we have doors downstairs. I always appreciate that. It's, it's very nice when they manage to incorporate doors. Hello, big bird. Yes. So this looks like a crafting area, I guess. Some food as well. Is that the... This is the, the cake that you get for wedding, right? It's hidden in the... Thing. What's behind the red door? First... Yes, that's the cake. I guess that's how you boil water for this? I like that they put this shower here, it kind of fits. So you can enjoy your sleep in a coffin with our bunkers. It's okay. Hmm. 
Very intimidating bird. Do we have any open rooms? No, no open rooms. That's okay. to strut along on our antler. This looks nice. Kum <laughs> Academy. Never. <laughs> Question mark. Interesting. Yeah, this is nice. The benches. I think this is a medium, right? Have to have the swing. What is giving all this light? Oh, are those? Those are like lanterns. Yeah, those are like lanterns put there. That's nice. Here's the frog. So I'm getting so many lost friends, which is not nice. Okay. Let's see indoors. Okay, that's a nice start. So straight in. The first thing we see when we walk in is this neat little fa fountain. I'm actually not sure what these blue things are. Elevated aquarium scenario look nice too. I might have to get some. Have a bit of a chilling corner. Some fish. Because they have some fishing people. Mm. Those are bottoms, right? Those are bottoms of the world. So. Yeah, very nice.
I really like those, like the windowed part parts of houses. I have some instruments in this one. I don't even want to go to this in first person because you know, there's a lot to see here. First person can be dizzy. I've noticed it's common for, for especially FC houses to have like a um, like a party area underground. I am not gonna. Lie, I would probably, uh, maybe not probably, but like I would be likely to do the same thing to put it underground. But same thing, like it's, it's very common. Like this, this, this support tender just sneaking in there. That's that's a nice use of the of the gold saucer beams. Like to use them as decorations. I like it. in the water mm -hmm. very nice uh, I wonder how this part was done Maybe this this must be a, an added wall, right? Yeah, this wall is added. I wonder if this is a burden partition or just regular planters. I think this might be just regular planters. in the wall. Okay. I'm keep that in mind. Can I see how tall this is? Oh, this is a stage, right? Yeah, I think this is a stage. about the, the height of a stage. That's an in interesting information there. So I was I was playing with the idea of having, of having a deck in my room. Can I sit in on this? No. So we have another trapped bird. No, I thought there this is an FC, so there may be rooms. There are 
have some open ones. Admit, it's not quite what I expected. I'm not sure what I expected, but it wasn't this. Um, yes. Yeah, Dak, we're going. We're leaving. <laughs> That's a nice one. It's like modern ish house. It's like a piano. I think I'm actually gonna do this in first person because there's a lot going on. Nice. What is the reflector so they can like shine on the, the piano when they're playing? It's neat. The windows are hidden in the wall to make like a single window. Okay, that's nice. And this staircase. What is this made of? Is this like a. Uh, it's a half partition, right? Maybe? No? Yes? Sleeping area. The curtains. And a small bookshelf made of the bigger nature. Oh, there's an aquarium here too! It's kind of small, but it's very interesting. Is this is this like a boss setup? Please tell me this is a boss setup. Like very, you know. 
This is what I call the bug practice. So please tell me this is like a setup for a boss fight and they're like actually training here. So that would be amazing. I love this. It's actually beautiful. It's a bit dark for my taste. Um, do I just jump? I guess so. Hold on, Duck. You can throw snowballs on these? Oh my god. Okay, I know what to put in our house. Well, it's nice. A little confusing, but nice. So how do I get out? It's a one-way trip. Can I jump back in? I can. Okay, good. And yes, I know you can get out. There's so many rooms actually. Let's go. Speed it up. So I'm taking way too long on each room. Number ten. Seriously, what is that? This is this is the glade bench, right? I mean glade round thingy. Glade sofa I think it's called. Just this room. This is it. There's nothing else here.
music. It's very interesting because we have like kind of traditional style restaurant and then this music in the background. Very clean. Oh, yes, I know this song. So I might have clipped through a few things. So we have like a restaurant of sorts. And here we have a stage. With a VIP area as well. I feel like this this the uh, the walls would benefit from a darker lighting. Because they're so intense. But hey. What? Okay. Some people just, you know, some people just do this. It's just... Yep. Oh my, intense. Someone has a... As an office of sorts. <laughs> the army of the muzzles. That's nice. It's very simple, very clean. It's neat. I'm not gonna go there just because of the description. <laughs> Screw that. <laughs> I am streaming, in fact.
Yes, triumphant music. Um. <laughs> so I'm just going through the private chambers of this FC house. Some of them are nice, some of them are just like solid question mark. Like the first one was the best. Nah, I'm not. Ah, uh, look. It's too much effort on this to, to make a VTuber. And I'm just here to chill. Uh, heck, I forgot which one we were in. I think this is what. So I still undecided if I should be doing this in first person because like I don't know, I get dizzy from first person after a while, it's just too fast. And another office over here. Now the go for your attack. Yeah, that would be a solution I guess. I should learn to use pillars to the advantage. They, they can be nice sometimes, but I just like keeping my space open. Okay, so that's about it. Let's go next. So unfortunately the entrance of this one is the other direction. So I'm not gonna jump through the garden. Yes, I'm slowly trotting on my antelope because I like it. The next house is closed so we're not gonna be going there. So we're going all the way to number 10. This is a good mount. I like this mount. This is one of my favorite mounts. I actually, I actually have it on a hotkey. I use it. This one or the chocobo. A designer home. Yes, that's what we're looking for. Starting with trees and a nice bathroom. We have one of these, but I don't know if I... We don't have any space to put it anywhere, so... I'm been putting it off. It's common to put the bamboo trees thingies in the in the pond. I don't think it's called a bamboo tree, is it? Hard questions. Nice music for the entrance. So 
we have like an office thing right here. Which is nice. This is a private house, so there are no rooms. But there is downstairs. So I like the use of the mobile screen. I, I kinda wanted to do that with ours as well, but I decided against it. Oh yeah, this is one of these. Okay, I think I've been here before. So here we have like a kitchen area. I'm gonna go to the first person. Like a kitchen area. And this, see the, the problem with this is that the ceiling is very, very close. Because this is like, you know, halfway and there's this thing here, this bar. So like, you know, I can fit, but like Vieras have a bit of a problem. Obviously, like the game will still allow you to go through, but no, it just looks a bit awkward. And yeah, I remember this place specifically because I, I'm actually, I'm inspired by this one. Because here we have the deck and then downstairs we have a garden of sorts. And that's something I kind of want to do in whenever we get the bigger house. I want to also make like a, like a, like a deck with a garden beneath. Like that's a really neat idea. I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna do it, but it is something I, I'm looking forward to. Have the showers here. And then get into this area where you can just chill. Have a bath. So I like I like this. I need to incorporate this somewhere. Just not sure where yet. But yeah, I really like the use of the trees in, in this in this house. Okay. Like whenever I'm I'm gonna Okay, that's that's an interesting place for the um, And there's a bed here. Them from everything. Yeah, whenever whenever I'm gonna be able to like do the underground garden, I, I definitely want to do something like this. But like it feels really nice. I don't want to say natural because it's still like planted in place. But like it just looks really neat. So the swimsuit. Okay, what's next? I guess we're gonna go for this medium house. It's really pretty with the trees here. Like, I, I'm all for putting trees like close to the fence so you know it, like the leaves are falling on the on the pavement and stuff makes makes it look more I don't want to say natural but like you know makes it gives it a bit of like a park residential area feeling Unfortunately, I feel like partially because of that, like the garden is a bit empty. Like, the front is nice, I, I like the front, but like the rest of the garden looks a little empty. It 
that's an interesting view. See everything from here. By everything, I mean just this place. But also, like, you know, you can see the horizon almost. one of these okay so on the front we have these people greeting us and the mannequin I guess and here I guess we have like the boat hanging area and then there's upstairs there's no downstairs this is one of these houses that you know they use the downstairs to make some Hold on. And now I'm having way too much fun with this. Interesting. It's interesting because I'm not sure what I'm looking at. Like why why is there a towel in the sitting slash bed area? And then here there's also a fountain. This this part is a little confusing. Other than that looks alright. I, I generally like these this alcove beds. I want to use one in my place. I'm not sure how yet, but I'm gonna be using one. Yes, I, I, I have to either zoom in really really, uh, really close, which means you mostly see Milika's head, or I have, have to go first person, which is like a struggle for me. So this is difficult. I hope you don't mind the back of Milika's head. It's gonna be here for a bit. Yeah, there's another one of these. Like, I... I am very confused. Like, the idea is nice that you have, like, these, these alcoves, but I'm confused about the towers and what's their purpose there. Looks like there's a secret area here. Very nice. I guess it's kind of like a bathhouse. Hmm? So, like, you know, you have this area for like an actual bath, and then you go there to like dry off or something. Also, we need to test something because I see what's going on here. Yep, you can sleep underwater. I, mean, I assume this is there for this purpose. You can, so you can sit on the bed and I'm sitting in the water. Which solves the problem of this specific bath not having sitting space. Still a bit, a bit confusing, I would say. So like, I really like this design. It's still confusing. So the curtains actually look nice. See, I'm very afraid of using the the stage curtains at home because they are like too fancy. But maybe actually it's not that bad. I 
Maybe if you dye it correctly and put it in a nice place, it can actually work out. It's something I will have to figure out at some point. These doors are something. Oh, there are more paintings there. A lot of curtains are being used here, which I like. I really like curtains. Another, 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 another alcove bed. I'm not sure what this is though. Can you also, also sit on that? I'll let you know. No. Okay, then I don't know what the purpose is. I guess it's a step. Yeah. I guess it's a step because you can walk on it. I could also keep downstairs, but I don't think it's gonna be much interesting to say. I know there's this one house we found in, in Goblet which actually has something downstairs despite being blocked off. But most of the time like there's nothing actually nothing there because they are just using that space to you know to glitch them. Add other furniture upstairs. Okay, so now we go here. This beautiful moon. What is that? I've never seen that before. I didn't read the placard. My bad. So one of them is on and the other isn't. Maybe I'm not confused. <laughs> Minimum wage heroes, Walmart. Okay. Here we go. It's very bright. It's okay. It's 
go upstairs first. Oh yeah, it's this one. Yeah, because I, I was in this specific world before. In this one and in Lavender Beds I was before. And this is the one with Ninja Turtles. Yes, that's what we call them. I know they have their own name in Final Fantasy, but yeah, Ninja Turtles. making a lot of noise. Yeah, this is a collection of shiny things. Doesn't look too bad, but I can it's clearly not like, you know, it's not like very organ. I don't want to say organized, but it's like not like made into a composition. It looks more like a collection of things. There's one last thing we need to check in this house. That is the rooms. Let's see what kind of rooms we're gonna find. Then if you dare, enter at your own risk. You know what? We're not gonna go there just just because. that if you're here this is your reminder to buy your own room so I can rate it I mean what was number 12 and now I'm torn should we just keep going through the houses or should we tr check out the you know what we're gonna check out the apartments simply because I I am looking for inspiration for an apartment so this may actually be useful Oh, there are a lot of apartments. Okay, let's see. Okay. So again, a bit of an office area. Yeah, with the bathroom.
Okay. Spooky room. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. Spooky room indeed. Oh, I think I've been here. Oh yeah, I think. Maybe? Or have I? Oh, let's find out. Oh, I can move. Am I just stuck? Hold on. Am I just like... Did I spawn in the wall? Yeah, okay, so the creator of this room, you actually spawn in the wall. It's a little bit too close. You don't get stuck in the wall. Anyway. It's behind the corner. Really shiny things. Why are there so many clocks here? Is a head coming out? I will squeeze through. Uh oh. I didn't I didn't mean to squeeze through the wall. I can't see anything anyway. Just so many clocks. It's just clocks. Chairs with clocks. I'm not sure I'm getting anywhere in this maze. Um, yes, very creepy, thank you. Is this the end? Oh yeah, this is the end, okay. Well, this was a thing. And I don't feel like going. I don't feel like going through this whole thing again. It's a little too tight, like some areas are blocked. Uh, Sultana suit. Okay. Or sweet, is it? Hey, that's nice. That is really neat. Can I move back a little bit? Yeah, generally I try to like save the best ones so I remember them. And then when I need when I need some ideas I can just look at the screenshots and maybe something will come to mind. A neat spot for this on top of one of, one of these thingies. Like it, it, it doesn't look out of place at all. It's very nice. Yeah, no, I like it. Hmm. 
I'm not gonna be leaving comments today. Just because I don't know if I'm not gonna find something even better. But I've gotta definitely remember this one. And there is a limit of a single comment a day that you can leave. Um. Hey, that's that's a thing. So this is basically a photo studio. So you can like put your character here and just take pictures of them. I've been thinking about making a photo studio, but at the same time, I don't know. It sounds like a neat idea to think about. I may just like make a studio in whenever we get the bigger house. I may just make a like part of it a photo studio with like maybe with, like some plants and stuff to make it like more interesting, not just just like a photo place. Okay. The shark is a bit lonely. Oh, that's okay. Very simple. Okay, let's keep going. Because there is a lot of this. You're only on page two. Oh god. There are hearts, and the person is called Oni-san. Oh boy. And there's absolutely nothing in it. Okay. Very interesting color scheme with the blue. It's definitely okay, not bad. Looks nice. Interesting. Very interesting. I will actually give it a like. I'm gonna be giving out likes because I can get 50 of these, but I'm not gonna comment yet today. Maybe at the end of the stream if I feel like it. Home for lost cats. Let's see. Uh huh. Yes, very nice. Hold on. Ah, ooh, it's empty. That was a surprise because I look at the name of the person and I think he's almost called Prompto Argento. Almost. It's Prompto Argentine. <laughs> but yeah, that was. Yeah, Prompto is a Final Fantasy XV character and my favorite probably. Final Fantasy XV. This is both moody and kind of creepy. I'm not sure which. It's a bit dark. This is neat, but I don't understand the, the music. Obviously, like the music is probably just what the what the person likes. Clean and simple, and a goldfish. I like the color scheme. Like it's actually like you know it may be not like super over the top like on like 
on the amount of things and stuff, but like the lighting and color is nice. Like it's well put together. I think it's good. It's a simple one, but it's good. Nice. Okay, it's another one of these. Okay. Time to go first person because I can see. Oh my, it's, there's a lot happening here. Also, I think this is Kata's favorite song, Taco So Big. Oh no, why am I hearing it now? Spoilers. See, this is the thing, like... I understand why people would split it into rooms like this, like, you know... Like, it kinda like gives you the... The illusion, it kind of gives you the illusion that the house is bigger than it actually is because you have like all these different spaces. But at the same time, like, I have trouble navigating this because I have to do the whole thing in first person or I just, I just can't see where I'm going. Which is why I generally try not to divide rooms until I, unless I have to. Like, I, I'm trying to be very careful about this so people can like, you know, actually see what's going on without without being Lala's Soko. Hello Soko. It was 34, right? 35. Okay, there's... that's very... Shiny. Oh my. Thirty-six. Okay. Luckily, you can see that, like you know, some of these apartments are just like you know, storage places, or like you know, or they are like still under construction, and that's completely fine. But I'm just I'm just checking out what there is. Yeah, like because this is what I was saying earlier, Soko, when I was going through this. That like when I, I when I go first person, like I tend to get very I don't want to say dizzy because it's not that bad, but like I just get very confused navigating when I'm on first person. So if I can help it, I prefer to to have it in third person. Like I can zoom like this and that's fine. But if I zoom like on my character and I still can't see where I'm going, then it's a problem. Forty. What table is this? Is this like an oasis desk? Or something? Or like a... Um, what is it? Flame desk? It looks kinda nice. Oh, 
for two free. Okay. 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 Yep. yep. Fish. Now, is the fish in the tank or are we in the tank? Oh yeah, Soko, on the beginning of the stream I saw a room that you would like in one of the FC houses. It was it was an experience to witness it. And I think it was like the first one or one of the first ones. So it caught me a bit a bit of guard. Okay. Um, fifty three. I don't like that sound. <laughs> yeah, this is nice. It's very colorful, but it's nice. Like it's 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 getting there in terms of colorfulness, but it's it's actually not like upsettingly colorful. If you know what I mean, it's not going over the top quite yet. I guess the fact that the walls have like a more calm pattern helps. Like it's still very colorful, but like it's not that intense. A nice fish tank, of course. Very, very loving room. A lot of hearts in here. Hold on, what is this down? Why? This is like a fairy thingy. It looks like the fairies of, that Scholar uses. The two fairies. The Eos and the other one. I forgot her name. That's nice. Fifty four. Up, up to, yeah, this looks like one of these storage places where this just this just Yep, this just a lot. It's like more like a gallery. It's an interesting way to use this, this banner thingy. Huh. I do have an aquarium to decorate, but it's not this big, it's, it's the smaller one. But still, this, this could be actually interesting, especially when you pair it up with the one with the bamboo thingies, the bamboo constructions. That could actually have like a nice, nice look. That's something I might consider. Fifty-five. Mm -hmm. Fifty-eight. Fifty-nine. Very dark. I think. It's okay. Now yeah, we have the buff hidden here. It's all right. Hmm, 
Okay. Now we're getting to something more interesting. I love this part. Like, there's a lot going on, I will admit, but like, this. Oh, it, and we just got here as, as the day started, so all the light comes in as well. Okay, this is pretty nice. It's time for screenshots. Yeah, it's like very like, you know, there's a lot of plants here. It's like one of the things that I would really like, I would like to like, you know, have a place that just has a ton of plants. Like make it like a kind of like a secret garden of sorts. I may just do that in my own room. I don't know if I will put that many flowers in it. Because I don't know, something about it just feels wrong. Not for the flowers, but more than like, you know, I do have pollen allergies and something just sticks me off when I see this. It's too much. I don't want to do that. This is really cool. And the colors are like very interesting too. Like, I would, I would say the colors are very like non-standard. There's a lot of like... Is it turquoise? I think it's a turquoise, right? It's it's really nice. I like it. Yeah, can I make like it like dead center? Okay, yeah. That's neat. That's something I will definitely think about when making my, my place. I may in fact actually uh, try this, this this specific part with the with the two skylights connecting and a place there. This actually looks really interesting. That's maybe something I add to my room. I, yeah, I don't know. But now I'm thinking about it. I may just like do it, like like just add like two like a lot of plants everywhere. But I feel like this is a little too much for my room. So maybe I wouldn't add that much. But like th this whole idea I, I kinda like this. I may I may just try this. Interesting. Okay. Uh, there is a book, right? Yeah, today I'm giving likes to the only one like. It's great. So in case you want to leave a nice comment, it's in Goblet World One. Apartment sixty, I want to say. Yeah, it's apartment sixty. Nine four sixty one. Nice. This is 
again, I need to zoom a bit. It's neat. The music choice is interesting too. I know I probably shouldn't be really judging music, music choice since just whatever people like. But even in my own like room, I, I like to leave music that was fitting for the room. So if somebody comes by, they get a nice mood. Now once again I don't remember which which apartment it was. Ah, 64. This was 64. Okay. 68. <coughs> so that is Garuda music, one of my favorites. There's no 69, it's locked. 70. I will give, give this room 10 out of 10 on the on the surprise effect. When you just walk in and it's just this. Someone cue the music from the Odyssey. What am I even looking at? So confused. Can I jump on top of it? Oh, I can. Is it like a stage? Oh, it's maybe a stage. Look, because there are like reflectors there as well. I can use it as a stage, I guess. That's a thing. Okay then. Seventy-one. nice. I really like the connection of this of these colorful windows with the regular ones. Makes it look a bit like there there are like some kind of like shades or something on. Which is nice. Yeah I like the tall windows. Connect. 
That's also nice. This is like this very like old house kinda look. We have like this corner with the chair and everything. Nice. That's again a simple one. A nice one. Very neat. Now, do we think there's something hiding behind this wall? Because there's no reason for this wall to be in this in this shape, other than you know just making the room a bit different. There's nothing here. Okay, good to know. Seventy-three. Another office room. I <laughs> got the orchestra is the other way. And that was 78, right? So now it's 80. I think I kind of like the diagonal walls. They have their own thing. Like, it's an interesting idea. Something that I, I should use more, but I, I just don't quite have ideas yet. Like, my brain is very straight lines, you know? Like, I like straight angles and straight lines, even though there's no reason for me to do that. It's just like my brain tells me like that's, that's how I'm supposed to place things. Nice deck too. Another aquarium. There's uh, quite a few aquariums here. <coughs> the flower shop at 86. Let's see. Oh my, it's indeed a flower shop.
So we have a small kitchen. Table for eating. What's on the deck? Okay, so the bed is on the deck. So this is, I guess, like the the back of the store where the owner lives. Oh, that's not a really nice bathroom. Kinda nice. Yeah, sure, I'll give it a like. Seven. Under construction, but we'll see anyway. So sad. Verdant partitions are so nice, so useful for so many things, but they are also very expensive. They are very expensive. They are not that expensive. They are pretty expensive. Because you can't like craft them, you have to actually get them as a dungeon drop, I believe. So that's a bit of a pain. <coughs> and this is the last one, the 88. Once again, it's carry sound. That one's very... Very shiny. It's a lot of things that are shiny here. I like how they covered one of the windows. Okay. So back to houses. Yeah, the, the, the Sultana suit was the, the, the best from... Or sweet? Is it sweet or is it sweet? It's sweet, right? But yeah, the Sultana suit was the nicest from this collection, I think. Like, it had like... It was, it was like very open, like it was a proper room. But it was like very nice. Okay, where to next? I guess 13, the mansion? I think that's on next on our route. Or route. Look, English is hard. Okay, we have chocobos in the, in the pool. So hold on. As is the rule. First the placard. Where am I? Pompous top hats. I am not tr gonna try to read that. Okay. By the way, we have a really nice day today. Very nice weather. No, no. Oh, there's a second container. God damn it. Squeenix, let us let us have a box for the ladas.
at the entrance we have these desks. So Soko, how do you like this one? How do you like the uh, the etherical wheel stand with the picture? That is nice. It's very fancy. So there are like the aquariums and then upstairs. There's actually it's actually a bathing area. It's so interesting. Another buff here. Let's see upstairs first. I like this. I like that the the sinks are actually put into the cabin into the cabinet. So they look like they are mounted on top. Something that's very common nowadays. I would say. So don't mind me as I keep forgetting which button to press. Very nice from here as well. <coughs> I like how they have all the different kinds of, of wardrobes and stuff.
It's a door. You must know what's behind the door. Looks like a conference table. like the bathtubs, don't they? Part of me wants to incorporate the nice embrace somewhere, in some way. It's generally like, it's nice because it's big, like there's a lot of water, but like also like the whole decoration part is also big, so it makes it hard to fit anywhere. It's time. You know what time it is? It's time to check what are the rooms. How many rooms there may be? Oh boy. Eh, it's not that bad. So I've seen the room with the same description. I wonder if this will be similar. Okay, this one is dark but intense. Yes, I do inspect the rooms because, as I said, like I am looking for inspiration for my own room. So like I am looking for designs that fit in that specific space. a lot of fish on with the background of more fish the stand. Welcome to the chill stream. And welcome the stands people. This is a chill stream. We just we just browsing rooms of other people because I'm looking for inspiration for my own decorations. So we're just chilling and checking things out. Stand please. This is what I normally sound like. When I'm not voice acting. Well, number six. We've seen some interesting ones so far. This this one is intense. There is a lot going on. It's usually the ha Halloween ones that seem to have a lot going on. I mean. Number six, number ten.
Hey, interesting use of verdant partitions to make sort of a gallery for the for the fish tanks. It's kind of nice. I guess I could do that. I could have a verdant partition to like kind of you know enclose the tank. But it's once again, it's like the big tank. It's a huge one. I mean, yeah, I could probably get one. Just like, is that something I want? Nice triple bed. Might as well. <coughs> also, they use the, the Garuda couch for this effect, which is interesting. Something to keep in mind. To so those ten thirteen. Nope. And that's all for for this one. Nothing like waking up in the evening and smacking your head on the wings on your way up from bed. Look, it could be worse. So the wings are actually out of the way. They, 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 they are fine. They, they create an interesting effect. Okay, time to straddle my antelope once again. So next we will go be going to number eight, right? You mean light? Yeah, light is sleeping now. It's like the middle of the night for him. I'm probably not gonna be streaming too much longer. I I kind of want to finish this this like whole housing area. So like I can like tick it off that like I already did, did this one, but I do sleep that stun in fact. Okay, let's see what this place is all about. Definitely, yeah. hmm. Two different, <laughs> different. Uh, what are they? Tonberries. Decoration.
Okay, this place is interesting. It kind of looks like, you know, like like there's supposed to be like a, a king or whoever here. Each drop of from Interesting. And a tonberry in a coffin, because of course there is. time for private chambers okay number one okay. tight spaces panic Number three. No, no, no. This may be nice. It's a kitchen area in the front. Okay, what's behind this door? Okay. I like the use of this actually. It's nice. Hey, found another one of the modern ones. So we have a floating deck with a kitchen area. What is this made of actually? I'm not quite sure. This part. It's, it's very clean, but it's also like what is it called? Sterile? Like there's just nothing in it. There's just nothing in here. But yeah, it's it's a nice one, a very modern one. was 10, it's 13. <laughs> there are secret namazos here, oh no. Six 
16. There's a lot more rooms left. Oh no. It's gonna take only forever. So once again, I, I can't see. Eh. It's just too much. Too much going on here. Seventeen. Eighteen. Okay. This one is nice. Interesting spot to put these slanted partitions, or whatever they call. Nineteen. music choice though. Uh, 21. Is there anything there? Nope. I mean there's something. Twenty-two. Beautiful. Twenty four. Yep. Uh, Twenty nine. And that's all closed. Okay. So we're done with this house. Time for another one. I was upstairs, right? Yeah, I was. Zelda's Cafe. Okay, let's see it. Interesting. Oh, one of the elevated decks. I'm not sure. I'm still not sure how to make this, but it's 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 nice when some people have this. This kind of like a balcony. They use this to mask it too. That's, that's very nice. Let's see the inside. I think I entered the store.
Toka? What is this song? It's like a remix of another one, I think. It scares me. So this lamp is floating. That's nice though. Oh, it's a remix from Shadow Beings. Kinda nice. Yeah, once again we have the Lim Lion and the Verdant Partition. It's a very nice those are very nice like pieces of furniture. But you know. You can't fit them everywhere. Also this is this is uh, mixed up with a uh, the bathtub, right? Yeah this is a bathtub. of cheese and more cheese. It's kinda nice. Now what is gonna get a like? Awkward moment when you pass through the door and your camera stays there. Hold on, there was no extra rooms, right? No, there's no extra rooms. Hmm? Avoid jump? Where? You mean these things? Or what? Where's the void jump? In the stairwell? Or am I supposed to like jump under under this thing? Oh! Uh, oh! Oh. Well then, welcome to the void. Where we have a uh, spirit figgy, apparently. And that's about it. Eh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it didn't work. Yeah, so what can you tell me about the bird? Huh? Oh, you can see you can see the the other danger there as well. Look, if someone gives me the opportunity to jump on things, I will jump. On This whole place looks like a jumping puzzle. Oh! And I landed in the fountain. Okay, 
It's it's an interesting place. I will, I will give it that. There are some interesting things happening here. I don't know where I press, but it's okay. Um, so next should be... Well done. How do we get to number six? I guess we'll go to two first. Yeah, I think that's a better way. Club Cocoa. Now open. Tavern. Haunted experience. Okay, then. Also using the trees nicely on the edges of the garden, so they are like poking out. Always like that. Oh boy, what is gonna be haunted in this house? to haunt it yet it's a nice nice light right on this I guess they tell like haunting stories here question mark It's a lifted floor, I think. <laughs> so it's, I actually noticed that like almost every house has a Hildebrand picture. So cool, I kid you not. It's always somewhere. I don't know if you were here, uh, there was that one house uh, that had the picture inside of the ethereal wheel stand. Inside of the like mini stand. So it actually it actually looked like the, the background in, inside of the stand in, inside of the stand and like it fit it fit pretty well. A small haunted experience. I'm not sure. I, 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 it doesn't feel that haunted. I guess the fact that like the light only shines on this part is a bit, maybe. But at the same time, I don't know. I don't think tagging it as haunted, exp like haunted house, is appropriate. It's not scary enough. Okay, so now six. Do we just jump through? I don't want to go around. <laughs> okay, I can jump through. Just a house. No special information given.
Okay, so we have the desk, the reception desk, I guess. Let's go left. So the left is an office. Some maps. What about the right? The right looks like a storage of sorts. Going upstairs. So this is crafting area. This is a bedroom. With a dinging ping ding. Yes. It would be funny if it if you could actually use that as an alarm so it could like actually function like that. What is this made of? I think this is not one piece. Maybe the Hingan thingies? But I think they have an edge in this like straight. This is nice. Another eating part, a bit of a bakery, I guess. Interesting. The fish have some flowers in there. What's in here? Oh, those are like single bedrooms. Okay. Sure, why not? And above, that I can't see because this camera. Once again, this is a private house, right? So there is no rooms to explore. What's next on the list? So we did all of these. Uh, I guess we go to 15 next. Can we even go there? The answer is yes. This is a Ingan style house, a very beautiful. The Silver Moon, Far Eastern, and under renovation. So I'm sorry to the person who's renovating. I, I know it can be annoying when somebody comes when it's not ready. But hey, I'm just checking things out. 
Like, I'm not here to rate anybody's house or rate their progress. I do leave likes when I'm... W when I enjoy the design, but... I'm here to find inspirations. I like, need ideas that I can use in my own places. Oh, that's neat. So we have this thing. With the fish in the background as well. So the music. The music is just so not fitting for the place. It's a little bothering, not gonna lie. Like, I don't mind the music, but like, you know. It's it's marked as being like a far eastern place and then it just you know Yeah, time to you know, look at that. I guess it is sort of far eastern style, huh? But it's a remix. Sofas made into benches, because why not? Oh, this is nice. Actually, I don't, I don't think I should... How do I... How can I angle this so I can see it properly? This is nice. I don't know if I can call it a stage. I guess it is a stage. Right? It's really nice. The stairs in the middle. the star coming down the stairs <laughs> yeah no it's, it's nice I like, I, I like that this is like the center of the piece I guess it really fits interesting and this is the whole place like, there's nothing between this between like behind this I like this something I may and I'll try to use. I don't have space for this kind of construction though, because this is like two levels, right? I could make like a one level construction like this though. I like it. It's an interesting concept. So that was 15, so that's half of the area. Oh no. This is gonna take forever. Um, trying to 
figure out which way to go. I guess we go 20, 19 and so on. I think that would be best. Oh, I did not mean to jump, but it's okay. this fountain in general. It's nice. And it has a bench in front, like you can actually sit on it. It's like very royal, but at the same time, you have the more bullet than you know. The, the downstairs is very mobile. So, a lot of mongols going on. This w another one of these that like has the Garuda couch incorporated in the thingy. See what we have here. It's only one room. This is nice with the plants around it. Okay, so now we go into this place with all the palm trees. Looks like it's new because it's not even renamed. Maybe? Or maybe somebody just didn't have the time to work on that. There are some decorations here and there though. Yep, yep. We have the essentials. So I'm gonna take a guess that there's nothing in here. Yep. It's 
This is either fairly new or just somebody didn't have the time to decorate it. Oh, the rooms are actually closed. Maybe there aren't any rooms. Don't forget to hydrate kids. Okay, so this is 18. I'm so pissed. What? The, the names are something, but we'll check it out none of the rest. It's nice to put put like this around yeah, uh, the tree. So it looks like it's actually going around the tree. It's a cool idea. Look, the inside is actually really nice. Nice door. I think this sliding door. We have showers here. It's like the bathroom area. Yeah, I really like the, the upstairs. Upstairs is nice. The benches and everything. Like the stone actually fits really well. So is that all corn? It's just all corn, isn't it? Do we have any rooms? Uh, room number one. Okay, it's an okay room. Number three. It's actually nice, but very dark. A door? Okay, yes, there is. Oh, so there are two two beds. Okay. This is nice. The light on it. I'm not sure where the light is coming from. That's nice.
Is that is that uh, near music? Or is it also Final Fantasy? Because it sounds like near. I guess that this the singer, like the style of singing, I guess is like kind of characteristic for Nier. Number four. Interesting. Light shines true. spot There's something here. So we have like a kitchen thingy here. And there's a deck question mark. Looks like it's still under construction, but there it is. Oh oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, I I worked so hard to not have things like this because it's it is this triggers me. It's so unfortunate when you have two things like exactly at the same level and they try to like fight for which is supposed to be on top. It 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 does funny things. And I actually had to like play around this when I was doing the deck in my apartment because that happened uh, on the side of it because I had to two lofts on top of each other and and I had to I tried to hide it with a with a beam and then the beam would stick to wrong things and it was it was a battle so I'm not make like I'm not moving that deck ever because I'm not going through this again Give it a like. There you go. Okay, now seventeen has the entrance from the other side. Oh no, it's here. <gasps> There's someone there in the other house. Oh no. That's what I was afraid of. The stream is so late that people are actually online on the American servers. It's like, you know, it's, it's like, you know, just checking people's houses, like, it's, it's kind of awkward when they're, they're there. They see me running around their house and just checking them out. And another one of the decks. I mean, it is a nice view. Hmm. I think I've been here recently. Yeah, I remember this fountain specifically. It's like 
three or, or four like fountain thingies connected together. Which gives this really nice effect. And then you have this whole thing. New, yeah, this this opens as well. Oh, these are stairs made of shelves. Okay, I'm here. Which do I? Can you really see? Okay, I'm confused by the point of the stairs because they're not really leading anywhere. They're leading on top of this beam. Nope, I didn't jump there. On the other side. No, that's actually the only way to get there. Okay. Let's try this again then, shall we? I don't feel like it. Just gonna do this. Hold on. Okay, so here we have like a, a it's like a desk. Oh and there's a garden I think, maybe. Let me check. Oh god, maybe I can run forward. Okay. So I have a desk. We have a garden. Garden is nice. And he has the, the altar here as well. The altars are nice. You can do this. Yeah. And there's a place here. Yeah, it's weird that there's like no direct entrance there. Oh, I like this. This just put put the chest in the in the painting. Okay. Good. Like all the servants on the deck. Lighting. Duck, move away. I need a pre shot. Duck, come on, Duck. You can do it, Duck. Thank you. So here you can just jump straight into water. It's looking like it's like embracing the moon or something.
It's a nice, that's a nice one. A bit, a bit, not a lot of space here. The whole I, what the idea is. I feel like I, I like the entrance the most out of this place. Awkwardly walk to the other place because someone's in front of it. <gasps> they left. A normal home. Normal home, no need to check. Hmm. We'll see about that. The maze is definitely a good start. It's also the one that's like, you know, has nothing underneath. The training area. What's the on her legs? Interesting. Let's see what a normal home looks like. Okay, you got my interest. So is this the same song? Yes, the dolls staring at you through the flowers. So once again, it's so dark in here. Like a giant library. But flames that burn full bright. Yes. It's one of these. So good. It's happy for you, huh? Memories dim by shadowed heart. You can see it. In the waxing gloom. Did away my lover's moon. Watching as the world's trip to Souls cry a passion welling within. Sacrifice a finer belief to her kin. It's sort of a maze because, like, you know, there's it's just like things. Like these things, just dolls, a lot of dolls everywhere. I think this is a door, but I can barely see it. Yes, more dolls. It's so dark in here. Like I, you know, I have the lights on in my room, so I cannot see like almost anything here. Is there something behind this? I'm not sure there is. Yeah, it's the same place. Never mind. So that's a place. Totally normal home. Definitely normal. Okay, how many do we have left? It's 
so I guess we'll go to 22. I'm thinking which way we should go. Or we could start from this side. Yeah, let's go to 28 first. Does 28 have the, the entrance on the other side? What? What? Alright. Let's trap in. We're, stra we're, we're trapping there. to enter from the back I want to see the house how it was designed in the front yeah it's very out there place like I thought ours was out there but no this one is the most like you know it's outside of the area Anyway, let's see what it's... Dragon's Respite. We're all dragons at heart. Okay. Um, interesting. Black and white chocobo. Oh, did they? Oh, yeah, they have fireflies here. Nice. Let's see the inside. Okay. A rather basic one. Oh, it's this one. I don't know if you remember this screenshot. They're, they are conspiring. I don't know what they're doing, but they have a map of yours here, so I would be afraid. Okay, let's see. Okay, there are two, so let's go to number one. Not a lot in it, but I, I can understand the idea. Very, very flame. Everything is very flame here. <laughs> Greeting. Good luck. Um, um. Let's see how it goes. all I have to say in, on the topic. So what is... What, what? Why, why is there a fan guard in the corner? Click it, but it doesn't trigger. Yeah, it's, it knows it's there. I guess we're doing it this way. There you go. How do I click on the exit when I can't see it? No. 
Oh, you act it actually it actually blocks you. That's nice. Can you actually not leave? So close and help. How do I leave this? Do I have to teleport? Oh no, there must be a way. Found it. See, you can do it. This is very funny. Very funny. This one because it's closed. And a nice pathway, I guess. Uh, let's go to the big one first. Wait, black heart. Emikote Cafe. Oh yeah, I want this fountain eventually. I need to fit it in somewhere. It's a nice fountain. And also, also a swing. There's so many things I would like to have, but like the gardens are generally small. So you know. Let's see what I can get. I also want the bird buff. I want, I want, I want most of these things. That's not quite what I expected when I entered. Let's go forward first. So I like this balcony. It's a window partition, right? Yeah. Yeah. A window partition with some other things. Nice. How do I... So I can't open this cannon. But I, can. well, I can still picture it. The door is not gonna stop me. Of everything here. I don't think I was supposed to be here, but it's okay. You know, these kind of places usually have a lot of secrets. Um. Yes. Okay, I'll get back to this place. I want to see if there's anything upstairs. 
Well, there's a head of a dalmel with some eggs. I want to I want to see if I can get on top of the balcony. Okay. Not quite sure where the balcony is. But I assume it's here. I guess it makes me lower, right? So it's like under here? That's too far. Hold on. Hold on, I'm working on it. Where's the balcony? There's just a lot of things here. I just wanted to creep into a balcony. There is light coming from there, so maybe it's there? Nope, too far. Okay, where is the balcony? It's like close to this wall. Let's try again. Like this way we're locked in. Damn it, Steve. See, I've seen a few dharmas. So cool. Okay, so where can I... Where can the... Balcony be? Maybe here? Oh, I landed on something. Yeah, look at that. We made it. I can see. Is there any pose I could do? What if I just... Hold on. Yeah, I know, I'm having too much fun with this. I said I would be... I would be finishing this stream soon but I'm just too busy making dumb pictures. Mmm nice she just walked into a wall. It's not quite what I wanted. Hmm. No the lights went out. Oh well. Well, I had fun with this. Time to go downstairs. Oh, I like this part. This is nice. That is something I may want to do. So we're talking about. Sorry, we're talking about turning my my room in a bit of a garden. So having all sorts of things hanging there may also be nice. Oh, this is starting well. I find it interesting how they keep mixing like a lot of a lot of like greenery, a lot of plants, Ooh, nice. with with the with the rusty you know, factory things. It's an interesting vibe. He 
Okay, so I guess here we have a restaurant. So it seems like most of the houses we've been to today, are, like, they are picking like this really hardcore music. I don't know what it is today. These staircases are very interesting. Namazu cooking. Look, even the Namazu is on top of the thingy. I still don't know how people do that. How do they put them on this? I don't know if it works like with regular furniture. So I don't think it does. But I guess I can try. So it's bouncing to the music. the pawns. The pawns and some spare staircases, because why not? This area looks unfinished. Okay, you know what time it is. Show me to the private chambers. Number one, titled meeting room. It is indeed a meeting room. I'm not sure what I expected. Soko. Even here you have Hildebrand. It's everywhere. Number two. Um. Okay. Is it like a private stage? No, oh, there's something creepy about using this factory stuff everywhere. Number four. Okay, an 
nice office room. Number five. Okay, that is interesting. I will give you that. Very minimalistic. See, there is nothing here apart from this. Sassy enough to enter. Oh boy. This is just a regular room. It's like some people have these this like descriptions, but like it's just a regular room. Okay. Knock first. Oh, oh. But they're offline, right? It's fine. Oh, it's empty. Time to leave. <coughs> I guess they will get the like because the design itself is interesting. It works in some places better than in others, but it's definitely interesting. a few more houses left and then I'm gonna be ending this stream it's, it's actually late like it, this is taking longer than I thought it would I know that I'm like doing this very slowly and yes I'm slowly strutting on the antelope while I did but even then I, I think it took longer than I thought not a code hmm Plastic damage is also quite annoying. If I put a Bertha up top there. Once again, we go with the music. Is that it? This is it. That's the house. You know what? I'm going. Oh! Spacey. It's a book. And there's nothing on the right. The wall is not gonna stop me. Maybe. Found the orchestra, anyway. Is there anything downstairs? Nope. Well then. In case you wondered how it looks like downstairs in houses like this. Like you, you have to sacrifice the space in, in, when you want to have do some some of the fancy things. Personally, I always try to use as much space as possible. Like I generally try not to make, not to waste space if I can. Got 
Damn it. I'm looking at the map instead of the road. Don't text and drive. Okay, so next we're going to 25. Then we're going to 24. And then 22 and 23. That's, that's, that's the route. We can get. And that will be it for today. So another one, of course, Far Eastern. Sakura Hotel! Oh, there's even a designer is that uh, Yanina I Iris? Is that how you read that? Yeah, there's, there's even a designer is that. So I, did. I expect some good stuff. Mr. Mr. or Mrs. Yanina Iris and the Sakura Hotel. Do not disappoint me. Garden is nice. Kind of a tight space, but it fits. How long can I? I want to take some shots. See when, what's inside then. Okay, once again, I am stuck in this thing, which is that's already a small minus for me. This is too close, and I'm getting stuck in it when I look in. Other than that, I mean, this looks pretty good. Oh my god, it's so cute. Do you see what they did here? So this is the 
the phasma scape, right? The Azim step phasma scape. But to make it look like an like a C instead of the step, they they put like uh, blue colored boards here. So to like alter it to make it look like a like an ocean. There's a few of the Azim steps as well, I think. It's such a neat thing. It's such a small but neat thing. Yes, the duck, the duck almost believed it and jumped into the water. But yeah, there's a small thing, but it's really cool. I'm tempted to do it in, in my apartment now, but... I already finished the deck. <laughs> I don't know if I want to mess with it. Yeah, that's 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 really cool. It's like these small things that people just figured out how to do. Oh, I walked into things. shot without clipping into things. It's the first time I've seen that in the mod view. Okay, I haven't even seen like half of this house and I'm already... Like, this is gonna be good. this kimono hanger because I don't think it's a hanger I think it's like actually like a mannequin or something it must be a mannequin right hold on I need to do some some cleaning up into things because I, I need I need to have wider view to catch all of this and see here in this in this house they actually got the the right music for the style of the establishment that they have they actually you know it's a Sakura hotel so they actually put Japanese music on Yeah, this is very impressive. <laughs> I even have like this, this like shelf thingy, so you can read in the while taking a bath. It's really cool.
You see, it's one of those things that, like, this is great, but, like, this is all you get. Like, it's absolutely beautiful, but at the same time, like, you know, a lot of this space gets unused because, like, it takes clipping so many things. Duck, move away. Thank you. Oh yeah, I, I like it. It's a really nice one. Taking pictures. Wonder what this bed is made of. This may be a shell, maybe even a cheese collection. I'm not sure what this part is. I mean, I can try and look at it. That's not where I wanted to go, but it's okay. I wanted to look at the bed. Here's a thank you. It's right here. too tired for this. But this is a nice place. Like, really nice. I appreciate these parts the most, I think. Yeah. It's a, I think the bathroom is really too good too. Yeah, it's a good now. I assume this is the... Uh, the book? Tile number eight for room service. Yeah, this is really good. Guys, if you want to check it out, this is where it is. It's in... In Ultra's Goblet Ward 1. Under address... This was 20... 25. Get out. Okay, so now twenty four and two more. Okay. It's a disappointment like me. Oh no. It's a tavern. Well, let's check it out then, shall we? It's okay. Not too busy in here, but also like the stone. It's like very cold. 
Let's see what's downstairs. More stone. Oh, this part is like open. So I guess like a concert can be down here. And then I assume this is a bedroom. Yeah, bedroom and office of the owner. That's okay. Upstairs. Check out these two houses. War house. For Al Amigo. Okay. Yeah, they're uh, they're well prepared. The Al Amigo warriors. Deck upstairs too. How did I do the line? It's like a red line. Okay, hold on, we must investigate. Won't let me go through. I still don't know what that is. But there is a red line. This is downstairs. First, I want to check upstairs. This is this one. There's like a gallery in, on the wall. So 
here you see all the mannequins. I will say the Byakucha is very weird. I'm I'm confused by this whole construction. say it's a war room but the top of it is like really nice it's really neat okay one more oh boy A nice pillar. Once again, more healthy brown. They have a lot of posters. Light on the on the door. This part is very dark. Need some more light. In here. private chambers is one and it's unfinished okay so that was all in goblet world one uh, my um, my highlights were the Sakura Hotel and the Sultana's suit. Sultana's was really, really nice. Or sweet, was it? Look, English is difficult. But yeah, there was this one like uh, apartment that looked really nice. And yeah. That was the Goblet Ward 1. Without the subdivision. I guess I will do subdivision later. Not necessarily the next time, but later. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna try to do this every now and then. Not sure when exactly, because this took four hours. But... Look. I'll figure it out. Because I do need some ideas for my place. And with that... I will see you guys next time. Bye.